It's Chester Tower from Blue Pecan Computer Training. In this video, we're going to look at changing the default settings that Word gives you for headings and normal text and things like that. So, um, I open up Word. If I was to put in my heading and then apply a heading style up here, you can see it uses a particular color, it uses a particular font. If I just type normal text, it uses a particular font. Uh, it applies spacing between paragraphs, it applies a particular font size, etc, etc. So how do we say to Excel we want to use uh, different settings? Uh, well, one way of doing that is to um, change the styles in our current current document and then save those changes to a new style set. So I'm just going to show you how to do that. I'm just going to uh, open up my styles uh, task pane here. So that's on the home tab in the styles group. Open this up. Uh, what I'm going to do is modify a couple of these settings. So I'm going to change heading one. So in fact, it's green just as an example and it uses uh, that font and it uses a different font size. Now I could go through and I could change all of these things, but I'm only interested in my heading one and my normal um, style, which is the style that's by default used when you just type in your normal text. So if I modify that, I might say I want to use that font. Um, actually, let's just choose something a little bit different so you can see that it's obvious if I choose that. Um, we go for 11, that's fine, and let's say, just for argument's sake, we want it to be that colour. Now, I know you wouldn't use that colour, but I'm just making it obvious for you. Uh, click on OK. So, it doesn't look great, but it looks very different. So, if I now go to my Design tab, um, what I can do is, I've got all these style sets here. You can see as I place my mouse pointer over them, they change the styles that are being applied to um, my document. So a style set is basically a collection of styles. Now our style set is here and what I can do is actually save it. So if I, it's the first one here, you can see it by the colors that I've used there. So if I right click on it and say save and I'm going to call this test 3, um, that style set is now saved uh, in Word but I want it to be the style set that's used whenever I open uh, Word. So what I'm going to do is just click on this set as default button. Uh, click on yes here. Now this is in uh, Word 2013. But there should be similar settings in your other versions. If I close down Word and I've reopened Word, um, you can see that um, the settings that were in that style set are now being applied by default to my documents. So there's my normal style and then if I was to write a heading and apply my heading style. There we are, I have my green heading. So whenever I use Word now, it's going to use those set of styles.